And yeah, that's what I said to him. And yeah, and then she came all Hang on, Jimson's here. Hey Duncan. What? You came to work with me today? There's 10,000 dishes out the back. Go get a start on them. Oh, but I thought I'd be making coffees today. Oh no, I spoke to the manager and I told him some lies about you, so now he doesn't trust you. What? Why? Oh, just because like, I don't like you at all and I have no real reason for that. I've worked with you for three years. Yeah, I know, and I have not come around on you, like, at all. I see you more than my family. Yeah, I know, you'd think we would have formed some kind of bond or repertoire like all the other employees at this stage, but no, I just don't like you for whatever reason. What is the reason? I'm going to leave it vague so that you overthink it and consider every possible possibility and also rethink everything you do and your entire personality. Did I wrong you? It's possible, but I'll never tell. All right, Duncan, let's squash the beef. I got nothing against you. What's the deal? I've got no beef. You have beef. I've got no problem. You clearly do. No, I have no problem with you. You just stated a problem. Nope, no problem. All right. All right, I'm going to go out and hang out with some friends. you got to man the counter and also do all the dishes. Uh, and if they're not all done by the time I get back, I'm going to get you fired by the boss. You said there was no problem. There is no problem. Just man the counter and do the dishes. And I'm going to go and hang out with some friends. And don't tell anyone about this, ever. I can't man the shop for a day. Well, if you don't do it, I'm going to tell the boss you've been spitting in coffees. But I haven't been spitting in coffees. Who's he going to believe? His best employee of eight years? Or his other employee, who there's already rumours circulating around that they've been spitting in, in coffees. You've already started rumours? Oh, you know, word spreads around. I couldn't say who, where it starts, where it finishes. It's just the rumour mill. You are a menace. Also, no matter what happens, you've got to clock off at five o'clock when the shop closes. Even if it takes you another three hours to clean up all the dishes and stuff. That, that is not going on the payroll. Okay. It's illegal to ask me to do that. Plus, you're not even my manager. You can't tell me what to do. Well, if you don't, I'm going to tell everyone that you collect snails. Why would, why would you? That's not even that bad. That's the point. It's not bad enough to make everyone hate you, but it's just strange enough to make everyone think that you're a bit weird. You are sick. Like, hey, did you hear Jimson collects snails? Yeah, I did hear that. He is a bit odd, isn't he? You're a manipulating sicko. You get no break today either. What have I done to you? Nothing. And I hate you. Bye. I have promised I'll love you till the end.